You've probably heard about this site by now called Timu or Temu or whatever. They seem to be selling products at a ridiculously cheap price and well, most of your favorite influencers have already been sponsored by them. But some pretty shady news has come out about this company and its parent company. Timu is owned by Pinduoduo. It's a pretty huge Chinese e-commerce giant. They have quickly rose to fame and they have captured a lot of market share in China, like almost 13%. That is huge because China is a massive economy. But Pinduoduo has been caught with some controversial things like they spy on their users and all that. Now that they have been caught, all eyes are on their sister company or child company, Timu. How could they possibly be selling products for such a low price? They've already spent millions of dollars even promoting on Super Bowl. And actually, Murahar made a really great video on them, revealing that apparently they are losing $30 per order. And they are a loss leading company, meaning that they are operating based on a loss just to get more customers at any cost. It's a Silicon Valley model. This is the kind of shit that immediately shows up in the first Google results, okay? And again, it's just the kind of ick you don't want to get involved with, okay? Because who knows how bad things can get when an exploited app runs around. If this is a giant loss-leading application that's designed to harvest your information and send it to a foreign country, that's not something that should be promoted by anybody. And in my opinion, it should be shut down by governments, okay? I'm not even kidding. This is legitimate espionage that we are witnessing if this is all true. It's confirmed that according to a company insider that Timu is losing somewhere around an average of $30 per order just trying to break into the market that is North America, okay? So again, when you hear how big they are, how big they're getting, they're obviously operating on a loss. You think those cheap ass prices, that $7 Nintendo Switch exists for no reason? No, they're probably selling you really cheap goods, but obviously they're doing it because the more people that download their application, the more people that visit their website, allegedly the more data they are alleged to harvest. And of course, influencers who are paid a fat bag, most of them don't actually realize or look into it like this. They just think it's something like Wish.com or Shine or whatever. When in reality, this is a little bit more sinister than anybody can expect. You may have heard of many companies like Facebook, for instance, just acquiring users by burning money at first without making any profit and then finally running some kind of a monetization system. Timu seems to be following the same model, except they are an e-commerce company. They are literally selling products for money. So what is their end game here? Most people believe that it's your data. They are after your sensitive information by attracting you to their site with these crazy offers and then collecting as much demographic details from you as possible. In fact, there are allegations that the Timu website has malware and stuff running. Most of those are not really true, like they are borderline conspiracies at this point. Again, I'll link some ordinary gamer's video in the description. He has made two videos. Go take a look. They are really detailed. But bottom line is, please don't buy something from sites like these. They're just selling you some low quality garbage. Even though it's very affordable, it's not worth it. You're just buying e-waste. You're basically buying stuff that will not work in like two months and there are so many influencers promoting it even mr who's the boss made a video i'm kind of disappointed how could you possibly promote such a shitty company man and i also want to mention another interesting video in general like if you're wondering how do they ship products from china to around the world for very low prices serpent ZA has made a great video on that it's because un gives china some sanctions because they consider them a developing nation and they are a massive economy with so many advancements they are not really a developed nation at all. It's about time we take away their low shipment fees because they are flooding the markets with garbage products like this. Good goods aren't cheap, especially not this cheap. That's pretty much all I wanted to say. You know, the oldest rule on the internet still applies. If it seems too good to be true, it probably is. If they are selling products for so cheap and they are taking massive losses in the short term, their long term motivation is something different. I don't want to pass any allegations yet because I don't have evidence, but it's pretty obvious. We have seen this before. They are up to something for sure, we just don't know what it is, so best to stay away. Whatever it is they are doing with your data, trust me, it's not worth that $3 trinket you bought from them. Might as well pay a little bit more and buy from somewhat trusted sites like Amazon, even though Amazon does have a lot of Chinese crap. But at least Amazon is an American company and they are not gonna do something ridiculously crazy with your data. That's the world we live in, it's a give or take thing, nothing's perfect. But anyway, check out the links in the description, you will find out more about Timu.